Bye, Pete. It's not a damn Marvel movie. What's going on? Hope everybody is having a fantastic day. My name is Alex, if you did not know, and today we're gonna be checking out The Matrix. Don't believe the lies, deceit. I can be more than a rumor. All right, the time that I saw this, I had COVID whenever it was actually not great to have it, and I think I was a little, uh. Yeah, point being. I don't recall this movie. I know this is like the red pill, blue pill movie, and I am super excited for this because there has been a time whenever I was on somebody's podcast for work, and I made the mistake of not knowing what the hell this movie was whenever he made the reference of the red pill, blue pill. Now, I don't like showing this because it makes me look like a fucking idiot, but I love you guys, I trust you, you're here for my well-being, and I know that, so this is the clip. Maybe yeah. I have like a blue pill in one <laughs> and a red pill in the other. <laughs> Would you take the blue or the red pill? Which one was the blue one? Take the blue pill and learn just how deep the rabbit hole goes, or was that the red pill? That's Bradley Cooper. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't it? Isn't that limitless? Isn't that what you're talking about? Yeah. What? Are you talking? What movie are you talking about? Uh, the Matrix. Are, are you, you talking serious? about the Matrix? The pills. What's the What's the damn Bradley Cooper movie? Limitless. Limitless. It gives you the pill. Okay. Yeah. The, I know I'm wrong. It was clear and tiny. All right. All right. I'm wrong. I'll accept it. Embarrassing, right? Yeah, it hurts to watch that. That just goes to show that my entire damn life I've been living under a rock. I've been like this! <laughs> which is a perfect segue to the sponsor of today's video, which is Wonder. Now, Wonder's this badass app that takes the words that you type into it and it turns it into digital art. Made by AI, dude. And the crazy thing is it looks like it's made by people or like a picture taken, but it's made from artificial intelligence, which is fucking crazy. Like, look at this. That's literally all I did is I opened the Wonder app, right? I typed in living under a rock. Click create and let's see what it spits out. <laughs> that's me that's me right there dude literally living under a rock okay and what's actually also badass is i just got like my avatars in which i know i'm late for this but whatever check this out look at some of these man anime avatars what the hell curly haired avatars game of thrones avatars military neon pink haired oh shit what does that look like okay not bad not great but not bad Vaporwave, watercolor, it's sick, man. So whether you wanna bring this crazy weird idea that you have in your head to life, if you need to create any artwork or you're just struggling with inspiration and want this software to spit something out for you, you can click the link at the top of the description to download Wonder and get a free trial of the premium service. And what you're gonna get with the premium version is more than 20 different art styles. It's gonna be faster, there's not gonna be any ads, and there's just literally like an unlimited amount of potential that you could type into this thing and spits out some badass art. Anyway, before artificial intelligence takes over all of our minds, let's get back to the reaction video. I feel like I'm already rooting against this movie in the sense of my preference for Keanu Reeves' character. Cause I watched all the John Wick movies before I watched the Matrix movies. Is Keanu Reeves more John Wick or more Neo from the Matrix for y'all? Let me know down below in the comments. Let's start a war, shall we? When was this movie made? 1999? All right, so let's see if the graphics hold up and all the yeah. effects and shit. Is everything in place? We're gonna kill him, you understand that? Morpheus believes he is the one. Are you sure this line is clean? Yeah, of course I'm sure. I better go. Okay, some woman named Trinity. I know Morpheus. I think Morpheus was the dude in John Wick as well, right? I think so. Ray, boys! Hands in your head! Do it! Do it now! Confusion has already settled in. Great. Lieutenant, you were given specific orders. You give me that jurist my diction crap. You cram it up your ass. Jurist my diction. I think we can handle one little girl. That sounds really weird. I don't like that. Your old loose skin. They're bringing her down now. No, Lieutenant, your men are already dead. Like a kung fu type of movie, it looks like. You're gonna have to get to another exit. Are there any agents? Yes. God damn it. You have to focus, Trinity. Oh, that's Trinity. Bunnies. Oh, damn, dude. She just Peter Parker all over 
the place. Oh, that looks exactly like it did in Spider-Man, the 2002 one, which we just reacted to. Go check it out if you haven't seen it. Probably haven't. What you been doing, watching porn online? Come on. Oh God, get to the phone. Oh my God. Trinity? She got out of there probably, right? The the depth of field for that truck, it looked like it should have hit the phone booth way before, but we'll let it slide. It's 99, damn it. Come on. She got out. It doesn't matter. They all look literally the exact same. We have the name of their next target. The name is Neo. Their next target is Neo? Okay. What? How did that wake him up? Dude's got music blaring. How the hell did that wake him up? Oh God. Follow the white rabbit. Who is it? Keanu Reeves looks young as hell. You're two hours late. Two grand. Like a sketchy crew. What do you get for two grand back then? What the hell is that? You get caught using that. Yeah, I know, this never happened. You don't exist. You ever have that feeling where you're not sure if you're awake or still dreaming? Yeah, that's the constant state I live in, dude. It's called mescaline. Oh. It's the only way to fly. Oh, mescaline. Should we take him with us? No. It'll be fun. It'll be fun. Yes. I'm not gonna trust a chick with fucking 38. Oh shit, the white rabbit. 38 rings around her neck, bangs, and it does mescaline. When were people like recreationally using mescaline? What the hell is mescaline? Whatever. Hello, Neo. How do you know that name? I know a lot about you. Okay. My name is Trinity. Trinity, that was you on my computer. You're in danger. I brought you here to warn you. Wait. They're watching you, Neo. They're watching you? That's creepy as fuck. Why did she force him to follow the white rabbit and plant a girl with a rabbit tattoo to come up and shit? If that was her on the computer, she should've just said, yo, you're in danger, alert! It's the question that brought you here. You know the question? What is the Matrix? The answer is out there, Neo. It's looking for you, and it will find you. I, just, I hear about that more and more every day, dude. Especially with Andrew Tate shit going around, the Matrix this, the Matrix that. I feel like it's more prominent now than ever. Y'all believe in the Matrix? I don't even know what that fucking means right now. Guess we'll see. You believe that you are special, that somehow the rules do not apply to you. Obviously, you are mistaken. Dude, you look like a stuck up bastard, man. Either you choose to be at your desk on time from this day forth, or you choose to find yourself another job. Find yourself up my ass, buddy. Thomas Anderson? Yeah, that's me. What? Thomas Anderson? The quintessential example of like a dead end job in a cubicle, one of them old ass desks. <laughs> Do you know who this is? Morpheus? Morpheus. Yes. They're coming for you, Neo, and I don't know what they're going to do. Oh, Morpheus and Trinity aren't coming for Neo. They just know that the Matrix is coming for him. The elevator. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, shit. The cubicle across from you is empty. What, what if they- Go, now. Dude, that's so cool. How the hell does Morpheus know all this? Good. Now, outside, there is a scaffold. Oh, God. Hell no, dude. How do you know all this? We don't have time, Neo. No way. No way. This is crazy. There are two ways out of this building. One is that scaffold, the other is in their custody. Dude, my mind would instantly go to, holy shit, who the hell is Morpheus? How'd he get this number and is he with them? Oh, sweet God. Sweet God, dude. Sometimes I can't go on my balcony. I'm like, I look down, I'm like, oh, fuck. It's a terrifying sight. Ah, dude, this makes me nervous. Stop looking down. Oh my God. Oh my God. <sighs> my hands are just wet, bro. Okay. All right, let's see what they want. We know that you've been contacted by a certain individual morpheus and whatever you think you know about this man is irrelevant relevant give me my phone call he's a badass hey gargle this i know my rights i want my phone call what good is a phone call if you're unable to speak 
the hell does that mean? Was that a threat? Are you gonna hurt him? Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Dude, I don't remember any of this. You're going to help us, Mr. Anderson. Whether you want to. Oh! All right, well, you should have taken the deal. Damn, you got some hairy ass nipples, man. Oh, God. Oh, God! Wait, it was just a dream? Something tells me it wasn't just a fucking dream. It's gonna be Morpheus. This line is tapped, so I must be brief. But I've spent my entire life looking for you. What? Now, do you still want to meet? Yes. <laughs> then go to the Adam Street Bridge. If the phone was tapped, why the fuck would they say where they're meeting? More importantly, why are there no cops around right now? Right now, there's only one rule. Our way or the highway. What the hell does that saying even mean? You break it down, it's like, wh what highway? It doesn't mean anything. Lie back, lift up your shirt. Oh shit, that thing was real. Try and relax. Try and relax? <laughs> they pull that Sorry. metal crawfish out of his stomach? You see where the theme of this reaction is gonna go? I'm gonna go ahead and guess what's gonna happen, even though I've seen this movie, so it's in my subconscious somewhere. Oh, it does make me feel better about myself. Jesus oh. Christ, that thing's real! Ew! What did that do? Like, track his location or something? I'm just thinking about from the 99 perspective. I mean, this movie comes out, it's interesting, it's different, it's fucking sweet. editing no one's ever seen, super high-tech looking, like, nuts. He knows more than you can imagine. Oh shit, we're meeting Morpheus. Yup, I know that's Morpheus. At last. Do you believe in fate, Neil? I do. No. Okay. You're here because you know something. What you know you can't explain. It is this feeling that has brought you to me. Y'all feel like that in today's day and age? You know what I'm talking about? Kinda. The Matrix. It is the world that has been pulled over your eyes to blind you from the truth. That you are a slave, Neo. Okay. You take the blue pill. The story ends. You wake up in your bed and believe whatever you want to believe. You take the red pill. You stay in Wonderland. And I show you how deep the rabbit hole goes. Oh, shit. Take the red pill, dude. Imagine he just takes the blue pill right now. He's like, okay. And the movie ends. Remember, all I'm offering is the truth. Nothing more. Hell yeah, he takes the red pill. Also, are those pills just like placebo pills and it's like a representation of him choosing something? Like, does he actually have to take it? Couldn't he just say, give me the red one, and but not have to take it? I don't know. The pill you took is part of a trace program. Oh. It's designed to disrupt your input-output carrier signal so we can pinpoint your location. Oh, okay. It means buckle your seatbelt, Dorothy, because Kansas <laughs> is going bye-bye. Because we're going back to where the wizard lives. We're gonna stroke him, stroke him off. I really don't filter myself whenever I make these reactions. The first thing that pops in my head is what I say. Oh, what the fuck? Have you ever had a dream, Neo, that you were so sure was real? How would you know the difference between the dream world and the real world? Oh, that's a trippy ass question. You're making me contemplate life right here. Targeting almost there. Now, Tank, now. Oh God, what is he? What is he being born? Or? Oh God. What the fuck? Ew. What the hell is going on, dude? Why are we in these embryonic tanks filled with fucking smurf cum? The claw determines who will stay and who will go. A little Toy Story humor for you. Welcome to the real world. Real world. Those are weird words. Like real world is in the Matrix or the real world is in the one where he wasn't sedated. Oh my God. Your muscles have atrophied. We're rebuilding them. Why am I, sir? You've never used them before. 
What? Okay, so we're, we're still not supposed to know what the hell is happening. Neo doesn't know what the hell is going on. I would honestly do that procedure if I could just be jacked as hell. <gasps> oh, God. Is it just me or can y'all feel shit being pulled out of your body when you watch stuff like that? Like, I can feel it in my veins. This is the core where we broadcast our pirate signal and hack into the Matrix. Oh, my God. They hack into the Matrix. That is so cool. Tank and his big brother Dozer. The little one behind you is Mouse. I wish they named the big guy Mouse and the little guy Dozer. That would have been great. Try to relax. What the hell's gonna happen? I'll play the It's like when they say, if you're getting attacked by a shark, remain calm. What? How the fuck am I supposed to do that? Your appearance now is what we call residual self-image. It is the mental projection of your digital self. This is what shit's about to turn into. This is the world that you know. The world as it was at the end of the 20th century. It exists now only as part of a neural interactive simulation that we call the Matrix. <gasps> that is weird, dude. You've been living in a dream world, Neo. Oh my God, wait. This is the world as it exists today. Wait, what the fuck? That is such a crazy concept. The world that we're living in right now is a simulation, imagine that. Watch at the end of my life, I take off some headset and I was like, whoa, that was crazy. I'm at like some museum where I was like, hey, I want to experience life in the 2000s again. And I'm just living in this fucking simulation that feels like a lifetime, but it's really just like four or five seconds. Imagine that. Human beings are no longer born. We are grown. Dude, I'm not kidding, bro. I really think the technology in our society in our lifetime hasn't even spiked. It's still been a gradual increase over time, but I think it real soon shit's about to spike and it's gonna get scary as fuck. The Matrix is a computer generated dream world built to keep us under control in order to change a human being into this. What? No. What a fucking bomb drop, dude. I can't go back, can I? No. But if you could, would you really want to? Wow. That would be so sad. I don't, I mean, he doesn't have a wife or kids, right? But imagine you do, and you can't go back. Get some rest. You're going to need it. That sucks, dude, that once you take the pill, you can't go back. You're training. This is training. Honestly though, drop a comment right now, even if you did earlier, would, would you be taking the red or blue pill? I love my life here, man. I don't know. I may take the blue pill. I don't know. I'm fairly excited to see what you're capable of. If Morpheus is right, no. If you are, it's a very exciting time. Combat training. Fuck yeah. Oh dude, don't tell me, don't tell me you can just download shit into his brain. Hey, Mikey, I think he likes it. Whoa. Dude, I'd put the dictionary in my head. I'd put, oh my God, I'd put every type of fighting. Oh my God, that is cool. I know Kung Fu. <laughs> That's sick. Show me. Okay, I might be taking the red pill. I may just take the fucking red pill now. I may take the blue pill. What would you guys put in your brain? Give me five things. It can be the dictionary, it can be books, it can be lessons, it can be anything. Five things you'd put in your brain, let me know. That is so cool! Boy, this is fighting Neo. Hell yeah, grab your popcorn and M&Ms, mix them up, grab a fucking cherry Coke Icy and let's go. Time to watch the show. Damn, my boy's got ups. My boy's got him four or five steps up there. Holy shit. <laughs> Bunch of fancy footwork up the wall like a goddamn roach didn't do anything. You think that's air you're breathing now? What? Hmm. Wait, you don't need to breathe? <laughs> believe it he did it i'm trying to free your mind neo but i can only show you the door you have to walk through it you're the one that has to walk through it i'm the smartest guy alive load the jump program oh my 
god, no, 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 no. You have to let it all go, Neo. No, this is where I draw the line and be like, now you're trying to kill me. Is this a simulation? I don't know. Free your mind. Oh my god, don't look down. <sighs> Someone's gonna tell me he's gonna fall. Once if I made the first jump. But what if he does? Normally I would say that he's not gonna make it, but because they said that they hope he makes it, he might. Okay, no he doesn't. Oh shit! Everybody falls the first time. I did a VR headset one time. I was on the building and I literally could not jump off. It's insane what that VR shit can do to your brain. Absolutely insane. If you're killed in the Matrix, you die here. The body cannot live without the mind. Oh. So you can't die in the Matrix either. I don't remember you ever bringing me dinner. <laughs> Are you jealous much, dude? You got a glorious mustache. There's nothing to worry about. You have to understand. Most of these people are so inert, so hopelessly dependent on the system. So they don't even want to leave. Protected. Were you listening to me, Neo? <laughs> Neo's trying to get his dick wet. That's what he's trying to do. Look Got a half chub looking down the street. Oh. Sentient programs. Inside the Matrix, they are everyone, and they are no one. That is, okay. That doesn't make any damn sense. Makes things so complicated. Sooner or later. Someone is going to have to fight them. Someone. I love that shot of the reflection shot right here. Someone's gonna have to fight them, I wonder who. Look in the damn glasses, that's who. They will never be as strong or as fast as you can be. What are you trying to tell me? That I can dodge bullets? I'm trying to tell you that when you're ready, you won't have to. Won't have to dodge bullets? Why? Power of line. EMP. Armed. EMP. Electromagnetic pulse. EMP. What does that mean? Eat my pussy. Eat my pussy. Stop, Trinity. <laughs> now that's something that I remember from the Matrix is that falling green code Whoa. or whatever. Neo. <laughs> you scared the bejesus out of me. Got a shiny ass head, my guy. I want to rub it, but it's nice. I'll, I'll do that to it. So you're here to save the world. What do you say to something like that? Uh, the only thing to say. Slap the corn dogs on the table. It's time to bring Mama Bird home. As good as anything. After nine years, you know what I realize? Ignorance is bliss. Ignorance is bliss, man. Stupid people have it real easy. I don't want to remember nothing. And I want to be rich. You know, someone important. Like an actor. Whatever you want. Oh, that's cool. You get to pick the life you have when you go back into the Matrix? This guy wants to reverse it or what? Reinsert me into the Matrix. I'll get you what you want. Morpheus. Oh. You know, I, um, I wrote that program. The woman in the red dress. Oh, she's fine. Neo liked that. But if you'd like to meet her, I can arrange a much more personalized bill. You... The digital pimp hard at work. Hey, you want her to stroke you off? I got you. She'll give you a little. And the rest is history. You go in the room, grab your Randy Johnson, and start pitching. Mouse, stop. We got important shit to do. <laughs> Taking Neo to see her. See who? The Oracle. This is so cool. If this movie came out right now, I'd be like, this is fucking awesome. <laughs> the all white and the shades like that looks sick, dude. Keanu Reeves, it's like every badass movie he's in, he just, his wardrobe is all black. The Matrix cannot tell you who you are. But an Oracle can. That's different. What the hell is an Oracle? Did you go to her? Yes. What did she tell you? Oh, the Oracle's a her? We're here. Well, now I have to go through the rest of my day with peaked curiosity, thanks. Look at that trench coat vibe, I'm loving it. Who the, what am I, a goddamn spokesperson for McDonald's? I'm loving it. That would be awesome. McDonald's paid you just to say I'm loving it? I'd do it. I'm loving it! She's been with us since the beginning. And she's never wrong. Try not to think of it in terms of right and wrong. She is a guide, Neo. She can help you to find the path. I told you I can only show you the door. You have to walk through it. Hello, Neo. Who the hell are you? Wait, is this her? Is she the Oracle? Am I a dumbass? These are the other potentials. You can wait here. Oh my god. Damn telekinesis, kid? That was some wizardry right there. Do not try and bend the spoon. Only try to realize the truth. What truth? There is no spoon. What the fuck? 
Then you'll see that it is not the spoon that bends. It it's is your only mind. Yourself. The Oracle will see you now. Little girl taught him something in six seconds. That was badass. You're the Oracle? Not quite what you were expecting, right? No, but you look like you would have a great conversation and make some amazing, amazing food. <sighs> Smell good, don't they? I want some! And don't worry about the vase. What vase? Okay. That vase. <laughs> I'm sorry. How did you know? What's really going to bake your noodle later on is... Bake your noodle. Would you still have broken it if I hadn't said anything? Okay, just Did getting mind fucked oh. scene after scene. <laughs> being the one is just like being in love. You know it when you are? You just know it. Yeah. Through and through. Balls to bone. Balls to bones? It's oddly suggestive. Open your mouth, say ah. Uh. Uh. Oh, let me see your mouth, then let me see your balls and bone. Mama's gotta get hers. What? You already know what I'm going to tell you. That he is the one? I'm not the one. Sorry, oh. kid. You got the gift, but it looks like you're waiting for something. Wait, so he is the one? He's gotta be. Morpheus believes in you, Neo. He believes it so blindly that he's going to sacrifice his life to save yours. One of you is going to die. Which one will be up to you? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it? You're in control of your own life. Take a cookie. What was said was for you. And for you alone. Ah, it's stressful. Oh, that's a hard ass cookie. Woman, you burn the cookies. Oh. Are we gonna see, yeah, okay, good. About to say we're gonna see Mouse beaten off. Oh, deja vu. What did you just say? What is it? A deja vu is usually a glitch in the matrix. It happens when they change something. Let's go. That's crazy. This makes me feel like my life is turned upside down. Dude, you're a badass. Oh my God, wait, he's dying. Oh my God, he's dead. Neil. I hope the Oracle gave you some good news. Only thing that's a little cheesy about this movie is some of those quick like whip sound effects, but I mean, it's fine, dude. It came out in 99. Oh, dude. Why you have to cough? Isn't all the dust just a figment of your imagination? <coughs> okay. Oh. Oh. It's an agent! Oh. Oh. There's Morpheus sacrificing himself. The great Morpheus. <laughs> Morpheus is rim right in his fucking nose. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, dude, just Jasper whipped him. Take him. Wow. Oh my god, this has me on edge the entire movie, man. It feels like my chest is tight. God, what the fuck, man? Oh, God, dude, he crispy fried him. Hello, Trinity. Cypher, where's Tank? Ew. You know, I thought I was in love with you. Oh I used to God. dream about you. Oh, God, don't tell me he's gonna do something to her body right there. You killed them. What? Tired of fighting, I'm tired of this ship. You just fucked everything up for everybody, dude. Yo, mustached skinhead. Surprise, asshole. Oh, dude, you just straddled him up. You gave them Morpheus. He tricked us. How? If you would have told us the truth, we would have told you to shove that red pill right up your ass. And it's not oh. true, Cypher. He set us free. Cypher, I mean, you were the one who decided to take the risk. You didn't know what the pill did. So yeah, there's gonna be some shit that you might not agree with, you dumbass. All I do is pull a plug here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. my god. I go back to sleep, 
And when I wake up, I won't remember a goddamn thing. Oh, he was the one asking to be a movie star and shit. So he's gonna give him Morpheus, yeah. Please don't. Not like this. Dumbass. Not like this. Yeah, seriously, this boy sucks, dude. Oh, God. Too late. I mean, if Neo's the one, then there'd have to be some kind of a miracle to stop me. You are a messed up man. I don't believe it. <clears throat> believe it or not, you piece of shit, you're still gonna burn. Oh my God, he's alive? Let's go. Fuck that little ragdoll bitch. Yo, Oscar Mayer baloney looking ass. Fucking let's go make a birdhouse at Home Depot looking dude. What do they want? The leader of every ship is given codes to Zion's mainframe computer. Zion's more important than me, or you, or even Morpheus. Well, there has to be something that we can do. There is. We pull the plug. Pull the plug? Oh, so they can't hack into his brain. Now I'm remembering a bit. Neo goes back to save Morpheus, right? Can't kill him. No, 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 no! Stop. Okay, yeah. I'm going in. No, you're not. I'm not the one, Trinity. No, you have to be. I'm sorry, I'm not. Unless this is the way that you prove that you're the one. What are you doing? I'm going with you. No, you're not. And since I am the ranking officer on this ship, if you don't like it. Then you can suck yourself. Tank, load us up. Let's go! Neo and Trinity, come on! Do you humans move to an area and you multiply? <laughs> Literally a fucking virus. A virus. I'm a smart man! <laughs> Stupid. We are the cure. No, I don't buy it. Just the bullshit justification you tell yourself. Oh my god. John Wick's wet dream right here, dude. No one has ever done anything like this. Dude, confidence at an all-time high. Leave me with him. Why y'all all got them little skinny little drug dealing sunglasses on, man? You're inside. I can taste your stink. Ew, it's a disgusting thing. I must get out of here. I must get free. This dude looks like his breath smells like Big Red. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Back up. Stand back up. Your little ass revolver's not gonna do dick, bro. Bro, this bass line is like Seinfeld's older brother that did a bunch of drugs. Oh, 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 oh. Yo, that is clutch! What a shot right there! Look at all of this on the big screen in '99. Everybody's coming right now. Okay, yeah, get the car wheel in. Might as well pick up the gun that way. <laughs> that is sick. We got Uzis, is that what they are? Those are Uzis? <laughs> okay, well that was the most badass entrance. What were you doing? Yeah, it looked like you were fucking caressing his face and kissing him or something. <laughs> Oh gosh, let's go. Tell me they end up together in some romantic way. Oh, wow. <laughs> Find them and destroy them. They didn't even flinch, they didn't even move, dude. Oh my God, into his face? Okay, that's what, that's the, the thing everybody remembers from the Matrix. I'm not even gonna need to dodge bullets anymore because you do it naturally. Only human. Dodge this. Oh, oh, oh. Yo, Trinity, could you be any more badass? Can you fly that thing? Not yet. Oh my God, is it seriously that easy? Bluetooth, Okay, you're good. 
go. That is so cool. Ah. Uh. Dude, are you serious? <laughs> Holy shit. How can they possibly like dodge all that? And why is he not hitting them? Okay, there we go. Come on! Before they get you, come on! Gotcha! Holy shit! This is so cool! So I'm just kind of putting it together. Maybe that lady told Neo that he wasn't the one to get him to this point to where he saves Morpheus because she knew that he really was the one. I don't know. All the explosion scenes in this movie are so fucking cool. I know it. He's, He's the, one. the one. Thank you, I take credit for that. I attribute that to my just natural, innate sense of script writing subconsciously. Do you believe it now, Trinity? <laughs> Old homeless dude knocking them back. <laughs> Fuck. Oh my god, that's gonna be one of them, isn't it? <laughs> nah, go back to sleep, dude. You did some crack, you're fine. Neo, I wanna tell you something. Okay, tell him when you all get back! Go back! But I'm afraid of what it could mean if I do. <sighs> you don't have time. Please just tell him when you get back. Everything the Oracle told me has come true. What? Answer the phone! Oh my god, I knew it! Fuck. Oh, he That's shot the fucking person. phone? He's beginning to believe. Oh, he believes he is the one now. Oh. You're empty. So are, so are you. Like, it is just a little bit predictable, right? <laughs> I'm gonna enjoy watching you die. I don't think you're gonna see that day come, Cinnamon Stick. Let's go! You got a western shootout, you got kung fu, you got action, you got guns, you got glass and fire everywhere. This movie's fucking cool. Super sick. You hear that, Mr. Anderson? That is the sound of your death. My name is Neo. It is Neo. Dude, he just backwards spangled out of the train's way. Get me the hell out of here! Got a patch on an old exit, Wabash and Lake. The intensity, man. Did such a good job with this movie. <laughs> I'm not kidding, dude. My heart's beating so fast. I wish I had like a heart monitor y'all could see. I'm gonna need to take a damn Xanax after this. No. Fuck, man. Can he answer the phone before he dies in there? Oh, oh, oh. <clears throat> Wait, what the hell? D no, there's no way. There's no way. He's gone. No, he's not. The Oracle told me that I would fall in love. Oh, she does love Neo. You can't be dead. Because he's the one. Be because he's the one, right? Yup. Dude, action movie, western, ninja kung fu shit, and a love story all wrapped up in one? True love's first kiss set him free. Kinda though. He is the one, bitches! You know what that makes me want to do? That is so cool. shit he sees all the matrix he sees everything yeah yeah okay if y'all just shot 15 20 bullets at him and actually y'all just shot him in the fucking torso 10 times and that's not gonna kill him so your next course of action is let me go punch him you're a dumbass dude <laughs> oh. oh ew what the hell <laughs> Fucking hell!
<laughs> get the phone! <laughs> they make, I'm sorry, but they make a total fucking badass couple. Where we go from there is a choice I leave to you. Now, now are we just unplugging people? Damn it. Bang, bang. Yo, that's so cool. Seinfeld's brother comes slapping in. Wait, what? What the hell? I mean, that was a wild ride, dude. That is definitely one of those movies that you need to let sit and, and marinate. Marinate. I'm just stoked the way that this panned out because I have seen this movie before enough to like glean just a little bit more to help me have an understanding. And, and to be quite honest, I still feel like I was lost for a lot of this just in the sense of a very convoluted timeline where I'm not, I'm not necessarily sure at times what was real, what was what was a dream, what was a thought, what was reality, what was the matrix. What is reality? Is reality the matrix? And is the matrix just a different form of reality or is the matrix actually reality and reality is just a different form of what we think? Oh, it was extraordinarily well done. Not only does this movie hold true, but it's just a testament to what a great movie looks like in terms of the longevity, in terms of the storytelling. Uh, but this was a lot of fun, man. Just like really cool. And, and I know that there are probably three to four other Matrix movies. And I wanted to ask you guys the question of, are those all worth watching? Where do those movies stop being good? Do they Are they all amazingly fantastic that slap your fucking gooch like the first day of Christmas or what? But it's just one of those where like you get start thinking about life and what it really means and you get to the point and the realization that nobody on earth knows what anything means. Nobody on earth has anything figured out. So I think that The Matrix is just a really cool movie that has served a huge purpose in society of being like, yo, is this actually what we think it is or is it just a huge simulation? And I think that movies like that are really fun. They're very refreshing. They step outside of the box and just create something new, a different type of movie that really has an impact on the way that we think about the world. So this movie shaped society and shaped a culture and shaped a generation, really. So I think that that was really cool. And I really do appreciate you guys uh, watching this reaction with me, checking it out, fucking slapped me around like a battered stepmom. I don't know. Um, that was weird. All in all, super impressed, man. Really, really like that one. And again, I wanna say thank you guys so much for taking the time out of your busy day to check out these reactions. If you are not subscribed and you're still watching at this point in the video, so smash that subscribe button faster than you smash your own asshole. And now you're probably not going to do that because of what I just said. Either way, love you guys so much and I'll see you in the next one. Peace! Don't